practice together. So remember, as in any yoga practice, you want to do whatever feels right for you in this moment. Let your body and your breath, obviously, first of all, your breath guide you. And if you feel like you need to make a pause or stop or um, just do so, okay? My intention is totally to share with you a practice today, but you know better where you are in your practice and um, this is what feels right. So, uh, welcome Jorge, thank you for joining. So let's start, okay? We're gonna start practice today just in uh, easy seated pose. Start getting on your mats, breathing practice. Allow yourself to fully be connected to your breath. No matter what, if you lost that connection, intentionally go back to it. Cross your legs. If this shape doesn't work for you today, choose any other seated position that works for you. Take a moment to start feeling your sit bones grounded. Lengthen through your spine, soften your shoulders, soften your gaze. Gaze past the tip of your nose. Or close your eyes for a moment, allowing yourself to start becoming fully present. Bringing fully attention to your body and your body sensations. Fully attention to your breath. Your inhales and exhales in and out through your nose. Keep your lips gently closed. you find deeper and deeper stillness. Bring attention to other things, other movement, other sensations that are arising as you find yourself in this stillness shape. You might even notice so deeply the rhythm of your heart. Making your inhales and exhales the same length. Just a couple seconds to inhale. Just take notice of how your lungs start expanding. On your exhale, releasing all the air. Finding some pace here. Your choice. Ujjayi Pranayama, if you want to practice with that type of breath, slightly start constricting the back of your throat. Creating a deeper, resonating breath. As you move through your body, take notice of your center, lift the pelvic floor, press down below your navel in to find your center point gauge. Good. Squeeze and in, inhale, rise your arms up. Exhale, release your arms by your side. Inhale, rise your arms up. Exhale, release your arms by your side. One more time, breathe in, rise up. Exhale, arms by your side. You're sitting to the side of your mat. I'm just gonna adjust, extend your legs to the front of your mat, coming through your seat bones. Take a moment to flex your feet. Inhale, rise your arms up. 
Exhale, slowly hinge forward as far as you can reach. Inhale, your arms up. Exhale, slowly close your arms and go all the way to the back to cover your shoulders. Inhale, your arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, arms up. With your core, hinge back. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, forward fold. Just like that, inhale, reach up. Squeeze your center, go back. Start climbing a deeper engagement. Exhale, fold. Inhale, up. Open those arms, hold the mat. Inhale, up. Exhale, fold. Take a couple rounds of breath here in your forward fold. Breathing in and out through the nose, softening. Now a little bit more into this shape. Inhale, raise your arms up. Slowly start crossing your ankles. Start shifting your weight forward, finding your tabletop position. You want to find your knees under your hips, wrists under your shoulders. Spread your fingers out. This is a foundational pose. Don't let go of your core. Bring down the belly button. Inhale, when it's lifted up. Spine is long and length and drop the belly down. Front of your head, tailbone, bring this up for your cow pose. Take a moment here to feel that nice warm body stretch. Open up your heart. Exhale, round your spine, look at your navel. Press the mat away from you. You feel like moving through as you move through these shapes. Inhale, look up, belly down. Exhale, round your spine. Inhale, drop the belly down, gaze up. Exhale, gaze by your navel. Take a couple more of this. Take notice of your arms. They're fully extended. You're not softening your arms. Belly down, up, and rise. Inhale, bring your spine to neutral. Take a moment to send your hips back towards your heels, finding your child's pose. This is your resting pose. Anytime you want to take a pause on this practice, either seated or child's pose, take a pause. Inhale, come forward to a tabletop position. Exhale, tuck your toes under and press your hips up and back, downward facing dog. So you notice your hands are already there, shoulder width apart, your feet are hip distance apart. Maybe you wider your stance out a little bit more, whatever feels right, good for you. Take a couple rounds of, if you're breathing through your ujjayi breath, take a couple rounds of ujjayi breath here. Keep pressing, lengthening through the spine, tailbone is moving up and back. Now take notice of your hands. If you're putting too much weight on the edge of your hand, close to your wrist, See if you can evenly wait. Send some weight towards the fingertips. There you go. Take a nice inhale, come forward to a high plank. Bring your shoulders on top of your wrist. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Inhale, come forward to a high plank. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Connecting with your breath, inhale, go forward. Exhale, press back. Now start walking your hands all the way back towards your feet. You're in your forward fold in the back of your mat. This first time you can, you might bend the knees or not, or keep your legs straight. Just take a forward fold. Inhale, rest your arms all the way overhead. Exhale, forward fold. I'm dropping my thing. Inhale, now walk your hands forward to your high plank. Find that shape again. Exhale, downward facing dog and start walking your hands back towards your feet. Inhale, rise up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, walk your hands forward, find your plank. Exhale, press back through your downward dog all the way to your forward fold. Again, inhale, rise up, tadasana. Arms overhead, exhale, forward fold. 
Last one, inhale, go forward to a plank. Exhale, press back. You're in your forward fold. Take a couple rounds of breath. Beautiful, slowly bend the knees. Walk your hands forward, downward facing dog. This time look forward, bend the knees. Exhale, step all the way to the top of your mat. Baby steps or one big step. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, rise up, gaze up. Exhale, bring your hands to your heart center, Sama Stiki T. We'll start here first. Sun salutation A. Inhale, rise your arms up. Round it through your feet, lengthen into the spine, soften the shoulders, open, twist to the right, gaze past the right fingertips. Inhale, bring your arms back to center. Make a deeper twist, round through your feet, press your right foot down. Twist. Inhale, bring your arms back to center. Exhale, forward fold, gaze behind. Inhale, halfway up, look forward, long spine. Exhale, bend your knees, bend your hands on the mat, step it back, find your plank, hold it here, through your arms, full of breath. Breathe it in, breathe it out. This is too much for you today, bring your knees down to the mat. If you're ready to go through your chaturanga, bend the elbows, squeeze your elbows as you, elbows are pointing back and lower all the way down to the belly. Hands by your chest. Squeeze your elbows in, start rolling the shoulders blade back, broaden back, inhale, start lifting your heart for your baby cobra. Cobra, extend your arms, upper dog. Taking the knees and thighs away from the mat, pressing through the ten toes, beautiful. Exhale, tuck your toes under, hips up and back, downward facing dog. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step it all the way to the top of the mat. Inhale, halfway lengthen, look forward. Exhale, forward fold, touch your knees. Inhale, rise up, gaze up. Exhale, open twist to the right, we'll start again. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, open twist to the left, gaze back. See if you can open a little bit more, reach up, look up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, hands on the mat, step it back. We control lower, chatter on the tandasana. Halfway or all the way down to the belly. Roll the shoulder blade back, look up. Exhale, press back, downward facing down. Breathe in. Breathe out. Taking notice of your breath, guys. This is a breathing practice. Keep pressing your heels head down to the mat. Stretch a little bit deeper in your shoulders, move it away from your ears. Extend your arms, you're fully active. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step it or float it to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise. One more time, exhale, twist to the right. Open your arms. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, twist to the left. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, hands on the mat, step it back, bend your elbows, lower. With control, inhale, lift your heart. Squeeze them back, your shoulder blade, and press back. Remember, you keep your center. We call the bandas, engage. You're blocking two parts of your body to keep your core Build and strength. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step it all the way to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise. Keep it going. Follow your breath. Exhale. Inhale, rise. Up. Exhale, twist to the left. Inhale, up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, vinyasa through high to low push up. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, press back. Mukhasapasana. Stay connected to your breath. Breathe it in. Breathe it out. Just warming up. Breathe it in. 
Keep pressing your heels down. Feel a deeper stretch in the back of your legs. Don't let go of your arms. Keep that stretch going. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step it all the way to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, rise up. Gaze up. Exhale, bring your hands to your heart center, Sama CPT. Go into our second sun salutation, sun salutation B. Bend the knees, arms along your ears. Tailbone is moving down. Grounding through your feet. Feel the weight on, the, on your heels. Soften your shoulders. Couple rounds of breath here. Breathe in. Breathe out. Stay connected. Breathe in. Breathe out. Embracing each moment in your practice, being fully present, you're right here. We're all in this, toes together, even if we're practicing in different places, we are all connected. Take one more inhale. On your exhale, slowly start rising your arms all the way behind your back, as far as you can reach. So stretch your shoulders, extend your arms, and you look down. Maybe this shape allows you to go and sink a little bit deeper into it. Inhale, both arms come all the way to stand it, all the way overhead. Reach up, look up, and you are a little back knee here. Open your heart a little bit deeper. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, hands on the mat, step it back. Bend your elbows, turn right. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift the right leg up. That's it. Exhale, bring your knee to your right elbow. Go forward to that high line that we did before and try to touch your right elbow. Beautiful, keep pressing the mat away from you. Inhale, lift the right leg back up. Exhale, bring your knee to the left elbow. Twist it, squeeze your core. Inhale, press your right leg back up. Exhale, step your right foot forward. Back heel comes down to the mat, deepening that front knee. Inhale, arms up, find your warrior one. Soften the shoulders, left shoulder and hip are moving forward. You wanna use your hands to shift it a little bit and reach up, look up. Beautiful. Open up to your warrior two, extend your arms to a T, gaze past the right fingertips, warrior two. Keep your knee bent, turn your palm towards the sky, and go back. Lateral movement of your spine, gaze up. Feel that nice stretch. You're letting your body know where you're going. Bring it into the shape. Feel your back foot fully grounded. One more inhale. Exhale, both hands to the mat, lower chaturanga. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, press back. Downward facing dog. Inhale the left leg lift. Exhale, bring your knee to the left elbow. Come forward, squeeze your core. Inhale, left leg back up. Exhale, knee to the right elbow, squeeze and twist. Inhale, left leg back up. Exhale, step through, back heel down. Ready for your warrior one. Reach up, look up. Deep in the front knee. Back heel is grounded. Edge of the back foot down on the mat. Exhale, open to your warrior two, open your right hip and shoulder, extend your arms to a T. You can take your time to feel your hips fully open. Rotate out your left knee. Beautiful. Turn your palm up, reach back, reverse warrior, gaze up. Find the shape, keep your right leg active. Exhale, both hands to the mat, high and low push up. Inhale, lift, exhale, press back. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step it all the way to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair, bend your knees, lower from your tailbone, arms along your ears. We want to start this sequence again. 
Rising your arms all the way behind your back, squeeze and open. Inhale, extend your legs, arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, hands on the mat, step it back. Bend your elbows, chaturanga. Inhale, lift the heart. Exhale, downward facing. Inhale, the right leg lift. Exhale, start with your crunch, follow your breath. Inhale, lift the right leg up. Exhale, squeeze and twist. Beautiful. Inhale, press back up. Exhale, step through. Back heel down. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, open your hip and shoulder. Extend your arms. Warrior two. Turn your palm up. Reach back. Reverse warrior. We're going to add on some poses here. Exhale, come with your hand to the mat. The left hand comes inside of your right foot. Dragon flight twist. You extend your right arm, engage as the right fingertips. Beautiful. Bring your right hand down to the mat. Pull the left knee behind the right. That's it. That's your exhale as you lift your heart and find your heart seat. Crunch. Beautiful. Inhale, extend your leg out, bring the knee to your chest. Use your big toes, your um, peace fingers to grab your big toe or keep your knee bent. And if you're ready, extend your leg out, extend it like toes. That's it. Find your balance. Slowly send your leg foot all the way to the back of your mat. Step back, chatter up. That's it. Inhale, lift your heart, and press back, downward facing dog. Other side, inhale, the left leg lift. Starting as you know, crunch, one. Inhale, leg back up. Exhale, crunch, two, twist. Inhale, left leg back up. Exhale, step through, back heel down, warrior one, inhale. Exhale, open, warrior two. Inhale, reverse warrior. This is the add on, guys. Exhale, right hand comes down inside of the left foot. Find a long lunge. Find the shape and open up. Gaze to the fingertips. If that's not allowed or feels good, just look forward. That's it. Release your hand down. Pull the right knee behind the left. That's your corsi crunch. That's it. Hands to your heart center. Inhale, bring your leg plank to straight. You can grab your knee. You can stay here. Or if you're ready, grab the big toe with your peace finger. Extend your leg out. One more inhale. Exhale, step all the way to the back of your mat. Lower, chatter up. Inhale, forward. Exhale, Adhukha Shavasana. Downward facing dog. Bring it in. Breathe it out. Breathe it in. Breathe it out. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step it or float it to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair. Bend the knees. Exhale, swing your arms behind. Inhale, come all the way to straight. Back bend. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, hands on the mat, lower, chaturanga. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, press back. Inhale, the right leg lift. Exhale, touch your elbow. Inhale, press back. Exhale, touch the left elbow. Inhale, press back. Exhale, step through. Back heel down, warrior one. Exhale, open, warrior two. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, carry with your hands down to the mat. Inhale into your dragonfly twist. Exhale, pull the knee in. Find your curtsy. Inhale, extend your leg. Grab your knee or foot. Extend your leg out. Release on your exhale. Lower, chatter run. Inhale, lift your heart. 
Exhale, press back, downward facing. Inhale, the left leg is. Exhale, touch your elbow. Inhale, press back. Twist and crunch, right elbow. Inhale, press back. Exhale, step through, back heel down. Inhale, your warrior one. Exhale, open up, warrior two. Inhale, reverse, warrior. Follow your breath, keep that connection. Exhale, right hand down, find that low lunge to inhale, open, drag on fly. Exhale, pull the knee in, find your core low contraction right here. Inhale to bring the knee and extend your leg out or keep the knee bent, finding balance. Exhale, with control, step back, lower, turn around. Inhale, lift your heart, and press back, downward facing. Breathing in, breathing out. Keep reaching and extending, guys. There's only chances to find deeper places, heels pressing down to the mat. Squeeze your core, inhale, look forward. Exhale, step or float it to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair. Let's do it one more time. Exhale, swing your arms behind. If you find your rhythm, go for that. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, go through your vinyasa or skip your vinyasas. If you don't feel like doing the whole time vinyasas, inhale your right leg in. Exhale, start with your crunch. Inhale, press back up. Exhale, make a twist. Inhale, press back. Exhale, step through. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, hands on the mat. Inhale, dragonfly. Exhale, find your curtsy. Inhale, extend your leg. Exhale, lower, chatter one. Inhale, lift, cobra upper facing, exhale, downward facing, other side, inhale, the left leg. Exhale, start with your crunches. This is your dance. Follow your breath. Inhale, lift, step through, back heel down. Inhale, reach up, warrior one. Exhale, open. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, hands on the mat, low lunge to inhale, drive on fly. Exhale, control, need to pull in. Inhale to extend your leg up, long spine. Exhale, to low lunge, shadow up. Inhale, lift your heart. And exhale, press back. Downward facing dog, breathing in, breathing up. One more time, all the way through. If you're ready to step up to the top of your mat, do that. I'll guide you all the way. Once more, look forward and step it all the way to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair. Exhale, swing your arms. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, lower, chatter run. Inhale, lift your heart. And press back. Inhale, the right leg lift. Exhale, touch your elbow. I think we're doing awesome. Touch the left. Inhale, back. Exhale, step through, back heel down. Find your rhythm, warrior one. Follow your breath. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, both hands down to the mat. With control, open up, expand your heart. Exhale, squeeze in, lift your heart. Inhale, extend your leg up. Exhale, lower vinyasa. Woo. Inhale, lift, and press back, left side. Start with your crunches. One elbow, you little more crunches. One more, or two more. Step through, warrior one. Exhale, warrior two. 
Inhale, reverse. Exhale. Find your hands on the mat to open up the round of five. Exhale, pull the knee in, squeeze your core. Inhale, find your balance shape. Any strength you choose. And lower, chaturanga. Come on, rounds of breath. Downward facing dog, breathing in, breathing out, breathing in, breathe out. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step and float it to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, chair, bend your knees. Rise your arms along your ears. Find your chair pose, breathing in. Breathe it out, lower a little bit more. Bring your hands to your heart center. Lift your heels and lower a little bit more. Squeeze it lower down. Maybe you're hovering your heels. Find that fire. What is lighting you up in this moment? Feel the joy. Squeeze your inner thighs. Keep squeezing your center. Lift. Don't drown into this shape. One more inhale. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, hands on the mat, step it back, chaturanga. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Breathing in, breathing out. Inhale, right leg high. Exhale, right foot forward, all the way between your hands. Start shifting your weight towards your right foot. We're gonna come to airplane pose, so start shifting forward. You can keep your hands to start finding some balance here. Lift the left leg up. Bring your torso up. Find your airplane shape. Close the left hip. Squeeze your core. You're in a balanced shape. Right foot is fully grounded. You're looking for a T shape in your body. Just take a look and find it. With your center, if you fall down the shape, that's okay. You have time to go back stronger. Find it again. Squeeze your thigh, your glutes. See if you can close the left hip a little bit more. Extend your arms and your arms. Your middle fingers are reaching towards your back space. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Slowly bend the right knee, hands on the mat. Step it back, find your plank, take a couple rounds of breath here. Breathe in, in, breathe in out. One more time, breathe in. Make sure your wrists are under your shoulders and your hips are not drowning. You're pushing the mat away from you. Stay strong, squeeze, press. Don't let your shoulders drown behind your back. Protect them and lift yourself up. Breathe in, breathe out, downward dog, inhale the left leg, exhale, step the left foot forward, start shifting your weight towards the left, now your energy is going in that direction, gaze is forward as you start lifting up, right leg lift, pile to the floor, arms by your side, gaze it down, find a focus fold. so you find some stillness here, Stay steady, squeeze your center. Back foot is flexed, you're reaching energy towards it. Your back space, middle fingers pointing back. So your shoulders are not moving forward, your shoulders are moving back. As you feel fully grounded, breathe in, breathe out. One more time, breathe in. Woo. Breathe out. I have my hands here. Yeah. It's okay. Slowly bend the knee. Step back. Find your plank. Take a couple rounds of breath here. If this finding yourself in this plank is too much, maybe you can bend the elbows and find your forearm plank. Keep your elbows under your shoulders. Find some stillness here. Stay connected. To your Ujjayi Pranayama or just breathe your natural breath that you're using.
stay in control, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out. If you went down to your elbows, press yourself up, find your plank. Keep your core strong, beautiful, press back, downward facing dog, breathe it in, breathe it out. One more time, breathe in, breathe out. Step your right foot forward, all the way between your hands, and now step it back. And bring the left foot forward, and now step it back. Now can you bring the right foot forward, at the same time, swing your right foot back and the left foot forward. That's it. And now, other side. Same time. You send your left foot back, right foot forward. Leave your bottom up to create the space to shift, shift, and shift, and shift. That's it. Take a couple more of this. Finding some rhythm. Breathe it in and out through your nose. Turn and shift. That's it. Squeeze your core. But take one more. Find your downward dog. Breathe it in. Breathe it out. Now take notice of your downward dog. Maybe now you're able to go deeper into the shape because you're fully warm. Keep pressing your heels down to the mat. One more inhale. Exhale. Slowly bring your knees down to the mat, find your tabletop, and slowly send your hips back towards your heels, finding your child's pose. Breathe in, breathe out. One more time, breathe in. Ha, sigh through your mouth, release the hips. Breathe in, just melt on your child's pose for a moment. Soften in, into the shape, and letting go. Pull your attention on your body and how your body feels as you soften and Go deeper into the shape. Very, very slowly. Start bringing your heart up. Put your hands back. And start coming to a seated position. Extend your legs to the front of your mat. Bend the right knee. I'm going to do it to the front. Bend the right knee. Soften the right knee. Rounding through your seat bones. Left leg stays straight. Inhale, reach your arms up. Slowly shifting your torso towards the extended leg. Take a forward fold, reaching towards your foot. Couple rounds of breath here, handles your chest in a pose. slowly, bring your torso up, start extending your right leg and bend the left knee, we're switching sides, take your time to soften into the shape, your right leg stays straight, soften the left knee, inhale your arms up, again your torso is moving towards the extended leg, yeah, that's your direction, 
and slowly start hinging from your hips when you can no more. Just melt into this shape. Very, very slowly start bringing your torso up. Close your knee and extend your leg out. Both legs extended to the front of your mat. Inhale your arms up. Slowly hinge forward. Find your passion open as a pose. When you can no more, maybe melt a little bit, just a little bit. Maybe you're moving towards your big toes. If you don't have a space to grab them, just keep your hands on your legs. Or if you have a space, wrap your hands around your feet. Fold. Slowly bring your torso up. Very slowly, gentle with yourself. Start rolling to the back of your mat. Lay down on your mat. Bring your knees to your chest and give yourself a squeeze. Hold your knees in. You can rock side to side. Massaging your back. What feels good for you in this moment? Keep your knees bent. Soles of your feet facing towards the sky. Grab your big toes with your his fingers and let your knees open for your happy baby. Take a couple rounds of breath here. Close your knees, keep your knees bent, open your arms and make a twist, palms down, soften your shoulders into the ground and make a twist, letting the right knee fully melt on your mat, if you twist to the left side that's fine, let the knee that is closer to your mat to fully soften, do not hold anything, close your eyes. Slowly your knees come back to center. Find your spinal line now. Slowly, you know where you're going now. Making that twist to the other side. Soften into the shoulder. You don't want your shoulder to come up. See if you can adjust your back to fully ground and twist. You can gaze for the right shoulder or left, whatever you are working on. Bring your knees back to center. Give yourself a nice big hug. Rub your arms around your knees and squeeze your knees in. Release your feet down to the mat slowly. And now start extending your legs all the way to the front of your mat. Finding your Shavasana. Arms by your side. Palms facing up. For your final shake in this practice. Breathe in. <sighs> side through your mouth. Release. And take a nice rest. Softening every part of your body.
slowly, very, very slowly. Start bringing back movement to your body. Send your arms over here, give yourself a nice stretch. Bring your knees to your chest, give yourself a squeeze and roll to the side of your mat, taking a small pause on your tail pose. If you're ready to join me to close this practice, Come back to sit it, and let's all share one more breath. Inhale your arms up, place your palms together, exhale, bring your hands to your heart center. Take a moment to fill your heart with your thumbs or your full palm. Taking a moment of gratitude, just giving thanks or whatever reason or reasons you have today. I want to thank you for you to join me today in this practice, for sharing, for being connected. We all make this happened and I'm just fully, fully grateful to be able to share with you. Sending a big thought from you, from me, to the world of gratitude and love. Namaste.